upper shoulders. People say all day long, what else can I do? How can I stretch? All right, so we're gonna try to get that mid back right between your shoulder blades. That's what gets so tired sitting at front of your desk. Interlace those fingers and round. You can do the standing or sitting. Oh, just get into that place. Let that chest sink back, pull the belly in, round it. Now take those arms up over your head. Get really tall. And now we're gonna go to one side, going towards the left and up and to the right. Let those hips go out and up. So you're making a giant C, of course. And one more, out and up. Good, taking your hands behind you if that's available to you, rolling the shoulders back and down. Oh, feels so good. So the thoracic or the upper back, upper mid back does not get enough movement because we're sitting at the desk. Here we go, interlace the fingers, round, round, round. Really make yourself as rounded as you can. It feels good. You can pretend you're a bear scratching on a tree. Take your arms up, lift that chest, palms go up to the ceiling, and over, and up, and over, and up. Taking your hands behind you, stretch, rolling those shoulders back. Ah, feels so good. Take a break during the day. If you could do that five or six times, you know, every couple of hours, it'll make you feel so much better. You can do it seated, you could stand up. It's good to stand up just because you've been sitting. Move that body. You're as young as your spine. That's what Joseph Pilates said. So keep that spine moving. 